My journey through life is much like my journey in fitness in the beginning. And that's why I was so attracted to first form. And one of the core values was, or is, accountability. And when I began my fitness journey in 2005-ish, I didn't really hold myself accountable. So I would take two steps forward, one step back, a step forward, two steps back. And it wasn't until about 2010 when I started holding myself accountable. And the rest is history. I'm talking about 40 pounds later. Um, I had quit during this process. I quit. I mean, before this, I had quit smoking, drinking soda, changed up my nutrition, and I began working out every morning, Monday through Friday, without fail. Like, I didn't miss workouts unless I was extremely sick. Like I would go to work out when I was sick, especially pre-COVID. It was just like I just went. And then I found first form as I was opening my business and I was like, wow, this, this, this is dope. Um, somebody that's gonna hold, a company that's holding everyone accountable and that's their core value is accountability. I was like, yo, I, that's what I need because prior to most, much of my life didn't have accountability. So I was just doing whatever. I didn't take responsibility for my actions. I pointed the finger. So that value just resonated with now, I hold myself accountable every day. Sometimes people say, oh, you're too hard on yourself. And I'm like, no, and I have to hold myself accountable because who will? If you're saying I'm too easy on myself or too hard on myself, imagine what others would do, especially those that want my position in life. Can't let that happen. So... Hey, hold yourself accountable.